Hey everyone, it's an aging zombie here. In today's video, I wanted to talk about something that's been on my mind for a while, and that is development time for Call of Duty games. We've been getting a yearly release for the Call of Duty franchise since 2003. And with these yearly releases, this will, of course, put a lot of pressure on the development teams to get a game fully ready for release day. Granted, for the longest time, there have been three main studios working on the game. We have Infinity Ward bringing us Modern Warfare, Treyarch bringing us Black Ops, and Sledgehammer really uh, most notably bringing Advanced Warfare, and then they just kind of have these random offshoots of games. So we're seeing a carousel of developers release these titles, and thus it's not one studio making a game every year. Each studio gets maybe two or three years to develop their game before release. However, we have heard in the past that due to various issues, studios have had to scrap plans and kind of start over, or maybe step up and release a game out of cycle because another studio had too much happen and they wouldn't be able to deliver. This has caused some titles in the past to maybe not feel as good as previous releases from their respective studios, and this can come in the form of like maybe a weaker campaign experience or not a whole lot of multiplayer content at launch. Now this year with Black Ops 6, we are finally getting a game that has had a long development time. From my understanding, they've had a solid four years to work on this title. To me, there is big pressure on how well this game is going to be on release and received by the community. We're going to see if having more development time actually means anything. Or is Call of Duty just at a plateau and we just get roughly the same thing every year regardless of development time? I'm hoping for the former because I am such a big fan of the franchise as a whole. I have thoroughly enjoyed playing every single game except for there was a PSP exclusive I was not able to play. And I don't plan on stopping playing Call of Duty anytime soon. Modern Warfare 3's campaign was a big letdown for me. The multiplayer and zombies have been a lot of fun, but I'm ready to see what Treyarch has been cooking up this past four years. Maybe I'm getting my hopes up too high here, and time will tell if that's true or not. But let me know, what do you think? Uh, do you think having this extra development time will actually make for a better Call of Duty experience? Or has Call of Duty just kind of leveled out as far as what they offer and any new things that they bring? I hope everyone enjoyed this video. And until the next one, peace.